And one thing that interests me, Vaughn, you talk about the legacy and being that inspiration for others. The Pass Rush Summit that you host. Now, I think that's an interesting concept for a lot of people, maybe outside of the US, is to you bring these guys together, you all learn from e- each other. How did that conception come about? Was it there beforehand? And, and why is it that, that you do that? Um, I've always been a guy that like to link up with younger players and just help them out. And, um, you know, whenever um, the year of the Super Bowl in 2015, my position coach, he was with the Atlanta Falcons, and he was telling me that he wanted me to work with Vic Beasley because our game, our games were similar. And, um, you know, that following year we won a Super Bowl and I wasn't able to do it. And then the year after that, I had time to do it. We ended up not making the playoffs and I had time to do it. So... I um, hit up Vic Beasley, and I told him to come out to San Francisco. We was going to work out. We was going to watch fans. going to do the whole nine. Vic Beasley told the Atlanta, the Atlanta media, and the Atlanta media blew it up to a Von Miller Pastor or something. So I didn't create, like, you know, this. They blew it up to a Von Miller Pastor or something, and they said, um, what would a Von Miller Pastor or something look like? And I read that whole article, and I was just taking notes, like, yeah, you're right. Like, I should have people on the field for it two hours and an hour break. And then after that, I should watch film and then we should have lunch and, you know, we should all talk. And I, I took notes on that and I really just rode the wave of what they created. And I ended up creating the Pass Rush Summit, taking advantage of the opportunity. And um, it was exactly what I said, man. You know, for anything that, for everything that the Pass Rush Summit is and we try to do, at the end of the day, you know, I, it's just to get us all around each other, man. It's, it's the only spot where younger pass rushers can be with the, with the established pass rushers in the league and pick their brains. You know, everybody's not going to make it to the Pro Bowl. You know, everybody's not going to make it to the Super Bowl. And this is an event for us, for us pass rushers, for guys that are looking for more knowledge, guys that's trying to get better, um, guys that um, we watch film on each other all the time. I watch TJ Watt. I watch Aaron Donald all the time. And this is the one spot where we can get down and we can actually compare our notes on each other, man. We can all learn. We can all link and learn from each other. So it's called the pass. It's called the Von Miller Pass Rush Summit, but I get so much more out of it. You know, I get to be around uh, around these young pass rushers. I get to be around the guys that's popping off sacks, and we all get better in turn. Is there must be some things that you keep close to your chest though in in those summits or meetings? Um, for me, no, man. I, I'm so comfortable in my game, and it's not one thing that I just. I, in football, you can't really hide. Like it's not a. It's not like poker or like. You know, something like that where you hide like a strategy. You know, anything that I do on the football field, people can turn the film on and watch that, you know, and I'm just clarifying it for everybody else. And I'm just so um, confident in my ability. I really don't – I do things a certain way, just like Khalil Mack would do things in a certain way. And just because Khalil Mack is great at this doesn't mean that Von Miller would be great at that same thing. But if it's one thing that I could take from his game – that I can put into my game, that's what I do. And that's what the Pass Rush Summit is for, and it's for everybody.